what's up everybody i'm back with another video yeah i'm doing it i'm doing it don't mind my hair y'all my little puff puff i need to um straighten it with a hot comb i'm thinking about whether i should perm it or not but anyway welcome back to another video guys <clears throat> yeah today i'm doing a back to back um this one's gonna be fairly quick though um something little a little something, something, something a little quick. Um, one, because my phone, you, uh, if you guys know, I do record off my phone. And um, he's not at a percentage that I usually have it at. Usually my phone is in the 90s, 80s percentile. Um, but, um, yeah, so I'm going to try to make this video quick, and then plus, I really, I don't have a lot, but I wanted to do this video because this is my first time ever eating from Panera Bread, and the reason why is because I feel like it's, I feel like Panera Bread is just like Starbucks. You guys are higher than a motherfucker, so I don't really eat from them. Um, so yeah, but I was like, you know what, I was trying, uh, I, I said earlier in my video that I was going to cook something, but by the time the chicken had thawed out, it was a little too late. And then I had fell asleep earlier. Like I had to be a little nap. I had fell asleep. And then by the time I woke up, it was like three something. And usually when I make chicken and rice, I make my chicken for like hours. Um, maybe like three, four, five hours at a time, not at a time, but three, four hours. And if I just started cooking at like three, three something, I wouldn't have got done until probably around now or seven something. And I was like, nah, I ain't finna do that. So I was like, let me find a little something, something and just eat it or whatever for tonight. And then tomorrow... I'll make the chicken and rice or whatever. So I decided to go with Panera Bread. At first I was thinking Chick-fil-A. But then something in my spirit was like, girl, get a salad. Contrary to popular belief, I love, love salads. Love them, love them, love them, love them. I love salads. But this, um, so I got the... You pick two or whatever, like half, whether it be half salad, half soup, or half salad, half mac and cheese, or half sandwich, half salad. So I decided to get the half salad and half soup. <coughs> now, I've had this soup before, which is the broccoli cheddar cheese soup, but I've gotten it from, like, the supermarket. They have... A container it got the brand Panera Bread on it and it's broccoli cheddar soup I freaking love broccoli cheddar soup I used to eat broccoli cheddar soup when I was in high school <coughs> I would eat it with like my hoagies and shit but Panera Bread got some good broccoli cheddar soup I didn't know <laughs> this was the size of it I thought it would be a lot more bigger than that um so again, like I said, this video is gonna be really quick. And then right here, I have the baguette. I don't baguette, baguette. I don't know if I'm. Um, I might dip it in the soup. I don't know, but the soup is fairly good on its own. <coughs> and plus, I try not to eat bread like that. I don't know. I might break a piece or two off. But yeah, let's get it going, cause <coughs> I do also have to get back to what I was doing. So, I decided to record this because, again, this is my first time ever trying Panera Bread. Even though, you know, it's a salad, but still, I've never had Panera Bread before. But, if you are new here, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you turn on your post notifications so you'll be notified every time your girl posts a video. If you're not new here, you are a, you are a OG Day 1 A1 my then <clears throat> welcome back i love you all nonetheless um 
So let's get in. Let me say my grace and I'm going to get in. Again, excuse my head. I know earlier, the video I had earlier, I had my bonnet on, but I had to take it off. Because I've been trying to let my hair breathe. So I took my bonnet off. And now, um, y'all see my big head. My hair actually grew a lot. Um, but yeah. Heavenly Father, I come before you asking you to bless this food that I'm about to receive. Bless the hands that prepare it. Please allow it to be nourished into my body. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. So, this is the um, Greek goddess um, salad. First of all, I know it's a half salad, but come on now. Really? Panera bread? What the hell am I supposed to do with this little itty bitty bit of salad dressing? Like, look at that. What, 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 what am I supposed to do with that? Now, you, now, I am a person who uses a significant amount of salad dressing when, when she eats salad, when she eats salads, which I know I shouldn't, but... I do. And, um, not to make it sound like nasty or atrocious, but I like my salads to be wet. <laughs> I like every piece of morsel of lettuce or anything that's in it covered in salad dressing. And this just ain't going to do it for me. But I kind of ain't got no choice because. And something was telling me, something in my spirit was telling me, get extra salad dressing, just in case. But I ordered it off of Uber Eats, and there was no option for extra, um, to get, like, extra, um, okay, no. There was an option to get salad dressings, but it wasn't. I'm assuming this this dressing that I just poured in here is the dressing that goes with the salad, and they didn't have that option, which is Dookie poop and cheese. So even though I just poured um, even though I just poured um. salad dressing <clears throat> in the salad I'm going to start off with the um, soup because it's warm or it's hot and again just like earlier when I did the Korean hot dogs this literally just got delivered to my door so I don't want to move this up the frame y'all but Shoot, I don't want to spill it. That's the broccoli cherry soup. Which I'm pretty sure y'all know what broccoli cherry soup looks like. My daughter is over there chilling. She's currently eating as well. <clears throat> I started her feed after I woke up from my little nap, which was at like three something, and it's still going, because if you guys are my true subscribers, you guys know that my daughter gets fed through AG2. Yes, I do give her stuff by mouth sometimes. Yes, she can swallow, she just refuses to. But initially, generally, she gets fed through a food pump. So it's still currently going. And I'm gonna give you guys the first bite. 
I don't want to lean it over because I don't want it to spill on my table. So y'all got to eat like this. Okay. I think another reason why I like this soup is because I love broccoli. Out of any vegetable I eat, and I eat a lot of vegetables. Now, there's certain vegetables I don't like. But out of any vegetable that I eat, broccoli is my number one. Because so I'm probably only going to do like one or two pieces. And then I'm going to probably throw it in the bag. Because try not to eat bread like that, guys. Now, sometimes here and there, I'll have, I'll have, like, if I go grocery shopping, I'll buy, like, lunch meat and stuff. But that's only if I get, like, a taste for it. Left my body be like, bitch, we want sandwiches. Then I'll buy lunch meat and stuff to make sandwiches. Mm. Other than that, I try not to eat bread like that. What I really need to stay away from that I've tried a few times to stay away from is rice. Oh my goodness. I freaking love rice. Jasmine rice. So good. Especially when it's like Sticky. All right. I'm done with that. I got the TV on for my for my daughter. But I gotta mute it because document she watching doc stuff and and you know the theme song I want it to get copyrighted. I hope you guys had a wonderful day today. My day was okay. This weekend on Saturday, I'm going. Oh, I'm drinking um, Limpton green tea. I freaking love this drink, especially when it's real cold. Oh my god, that's the diet one, but I drink that one and the one that just says. Diet green tea, because to me, they both taste the same. But, um. I'm sorry, y'all. This should be so good. But, um. This weekend, Saturday, I'm going over to my mom's house. One, so I can go wash me and my daughter's clothes. Because my mom has a washer and dryer in her um, garage. Yes, the apartment complex where I live at, they do have a place like where you can do laundry at. <clears throat> 
but I don't feel comfortable with going to go wash my wash me and my daughter clothes leaving it there let it wash come back to my apartment and then guessing when it's going to stop and go over there because it's in a, it's in like a whole separate building it's not like oh downstairs or something you know what i mean it's more so close to the pool it's close to the office it got like its own building so I'd rather just go to my mom's house and wash our clothes there. Plus, I feel safer. I feel like nobody won't steal my stuff. Because I, 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 I have had that happen to me before. Um, when I used to live in West Virginia with my sister, with my older sister and her girlfriend... We used to take our laundry down to this place. I can't remember the name of it or whatever, but we used to take our laundry somewhere <clears throat> and wash it. And like a lot of people used to go there to wash their clothes, to, to chill and stuff like that. And then for some reason, my shit came up missing. It was like a, a whole bag of clothes. Uh, when I say I was so pissed, it wasn't all my clothes, but it was some of my clothes. It was a nice significant, ooh, ooh, it was a nice significant amount of clothes. When I say I was pissed, I was pissed. Sadly to say, and I don't tell this to a lot of people, I don't have a lot of clothes, you know. One, it's hard trying to find my size, you know, being a <coughs> plus size or BBW, whatever you want to call me, woman. And then trying to find um, affordable clothes so I don't have a lot of clothes I, I I got clothes but I don't have a lot like my now my sister my older sister she got a lot of clothes she got a lot of clothes she got a lot of shoes you know oh let me let me not be rude and give y'all first bite Y'all got it? It's good? Okay. So, yeah. Mmm. That salad dressing, it's different. Usually I eat ranch, ranch, Caesar, Italian, French. What's another one? Caesar, ranch, Italian, French. I think that's it. Those are the four go-to salad dressings. Now, don't get me wrong. I've had 
Thousand Island before. Blue cheese, but who eats salad with blue cheese? I think that's I think that's fucking weird. No, blue cheese and chicken wings, yeah. But with a salad, no. Um, I want to start getting into vinaigrette. I gotta find a good vinaigrette. That I can eat with any salad. Oh, another vegetable that I like, that I love. I can eat it by itself. Tomatoes. Freaking love tomatoes. Some of my family members don't like tomatoes. I'm like, y'all are crazy. Like, it gives whatever you're eating more flavor, like a burger or a hoagie or a salad. And not only does it enhance it, it enhances the flavor of the salad. It's also refreshing. I was just like, some of my family members don't like cucumbers or pickles. I don't get it. But yeah, you guys, so that's going on um, tomorrow. My stinky has therapy. She gets therapy at home. She was going out getting therapy, but now that she has her trach out, um, I'd rather her to get um, therapy at home. That way she's not in a facility where a lot of kids are. Here at home, it's just her and the therapist. Um, what else? So she has therapy tomorrow and Friday. And then Saturday, going to my mom's house. Wash clothes. While I'm over there, oh, and I got to, I told my mom I would get her, I would get her car washed. So while I'm doing, you know. While well, I'm over there washing clothes, get her car washed, get her truck washed, wash our clothes, and then I'm gonna run and go to the grocery store, pick up some stuff so I can bring it back home. It's good. I wish I had more dressing, though. Bacon, bacon bits, chicken, tomatoes, 
avocado. So it's basically a cop salad. But it's called Greek Goddess because of the dressing. And then the lettuce was like a mixture. It was like arugula, spinach, kale. I don't like kale. I've had kale by itself. It's fucking disgusting. But I can't remember if I had it cooked or raw. I think I had it cooked and it was freaking disgusting. But I love you guys so, so much. Um, thank you for tuning in. I love you all. Um, I'm going to go finish doing what I was doing. I'm charging my phone. Don't hurt, make sure you love yourself, love God, love others. And I will see you guys in another video.